87. Again, you would be a little bit concerned. <laughs> well, that was some pot from Brussels. Terrific action on the cue ball. Yeah, it's such an asset to have that cue power, which you might deem safe against most players, against Luca. We'll settle for that. Yeah, great shot. Wasn't made any easier by the referee saying, shh, just as you're about to deliver the cue. I think that was worse than any disturbance in a mobile phone, but... He's going to go out of his way to play on the other end. It's a nice flick. That won't make Karen Wilson feel any better. It's that full on, he's got no shot. All the nudges are going the way of the man at the table. Which would make it far too risky. Yeah, he obviously felt it was worth the risk. Uh, a great shot. Where again, you can see he had to make that. Um, we'll uh, just bring you up to date with how he clinched victory. And he did it in style against Fet Michael. Here in Yushan, which seems a little bit unfortunate for the world champion that he would be put on early. But anyway, he's got through the game. One. If he could have got a Sullivan in trouble there and got the red out, it could have been a frame winner. <laughs> oh, he's going to be snookered here, surely. It could be a vile snooker to hit this one. <laughs> Trump is in. Strange shot, wasn't it? Because he was hitting the black, that half ball. So, in a way, the red had to go in. It wasn't a shot to nothing. Well, that's a Neil Robertson special, and there's no doubt that there is mounting evidence to suggest. I think it's worth the gamble to try and get close to them. away 54 and that's a good 41 point lead try and clip one of these two onto the side cushion <laughs> well, that's one way of <laughs> maintaining the break that's what I would have done Nina Brown here he's looking at powering it into the middle screwing off the ball cushion coming back down the table yeah plays a shot very well again the harder you're hitting it more difficult to be accurate. Himself and Judd Trump thrive in those kind of shots. Yeah, he sort of finished in the worst spot, hasn't he? You know, if that had stopped or carried on running, he would have been on something. <laughs> That'll be that then for this frame. What a pot from Brussels. Uh, it, it, the form is definitely in there. I mean, we saw it yesterday and was seeing it in flashes today. <laughs> Didn't get the cannon. Now this is where things are getting very difficult now. How's he going to keep this break alive? Because it's starting to dry up. And they're not such good shots. He's miles away from position it's there. Nice. This is what I'm saying about him. He, he just can't work him out. But you could build up hope and say, right, he's going to miss in a minute. And then he plays a, a, as good a shot there was as bad the previous one was. So that's a, a really good shot. That is a superb yeah. shot, which just could be the way back into the frame for him. And he's potted it. That did help. He didn't have to play on the blue. 22 in front, one snooker needed. And he will not be playing for it. Terrific blue, so Vafai again. Well, 
And there's all the cue power that he possesses, take him around the angles. I don't know if he played exactly there, but he'll settle for being on that red. Yeah, it's not a shot you'd like to play yourself, but you're still fearful your opponent might get it, particularly with that little bit of first attempt that he had. <laughs> One. Yeah, it's one of those for Oliver Brown. There was sort of no right answer to what to do yeah. there, really. He couldn't force himself to play it. He knew this could happen, but... It's a brilliant shot because he didn't really like the cueing. He, he tried three or four ways and he was worried about hitting the, the pink with his cue. Didn't know what else to do. And... Uh, very difficult pot. Hang on, it's not, these balls haven't stopped rolling yet. Well, <laughs> there's good and bad news here. Not again, surely. Oh, no. Well, I know how he feels now. Because that is unbelievable. Yeah, this is not easy either. He's playing a big swerve. This is a, almost a masse. A great shot. It's not just that he's behind. Two, he's behind two. There's just been slight signs, a little bit frustrated. Well, he's going to play, and he's below the line of the bolt line here, playing around two cushions into the bunch. <laughs> Great shot, brilliant shot. Maybe the just take the pressure off his shoulders a bit now and start to. One makes him a, a good favourite in the frame. in behind him is fine and that's a pretty horrible snooker as long as the pink and black stay where they are a very awkward snooker which was called a miss and it might not have been foul check us in page four crucial frame this brilliant part but again I don't know what's going to come of any of it. He's going to play the snooker here. I think it's a crucial fray for, for, ja for Jackson anyway. It's uh, a long way from feeling comfortable out there, but it's a superb break, actually. Kind of fear for the cue ball in these situations, don't you, as he bullied that blue in.